I am a true advocate of the arts. Um, I was appointed to the uh, Fine Arts Commission in uh, June of 17, I believe. And <clears throat> about a year later, I became uh, the, uh, about six months later, I became the chair. And that's been a real rewarding experience for me because of charter change. There was a, there was a movement on the side of the, uh, the, the city to, um, I think, uh, Put the arts under Wrecking Park, not I think, to put the arts under Wrecking Park and to really get rid of the name. I think there's a lot in a title, there's a lot in, in, in a name, and I think the arts are the, um, the heart and soul of a community. And like I said earlier, um, it, when I'm in, in the city council seat, I'm going to take the lead to, in, a, in an effort to revitalize downtown, but also to celebrate the arts, to contact the Mexican and the Guatemalan consulates, the art community in the city of San Bernardino, and my colleagues on the board to launch an initiative to bring a San Bernardino International Latino Film Festival to downtown. We have that beautiful California theater that can be used for opening cer gala ceremonies, for award ceremonies for the filmmakers. We have we can partner with the, with the Mexican and Guatemalan co um, consulates to bring their artists to bring their film to our festival, and we can use our beautiful theaters downtown. It's tailor made. It's all compact. It's tailor made for a big a big uh, undertaking like what I'm talking about in terms of a film festival. And I think it will be an economic boom, not only to downtown, but the first ward.